from Sam Hewen sending out a heartfelt message to devoted fans, to fans being unable to cope with not being able to see the Highlanders anymore. Here's how the Outlander cast reacted to season eight being the final season. The show's coming back for an eighth season. But hold on to your kilts because it's going to be the final season. Sam Hewen, who plays the dashing Jamie Fraser, shared his reaction to the revelation. The actor expressed his excitement, saying he's over the moon to finally finish the epic story. He tweeted, What a journey! What a story! What fans! Sam also treated us to a video featuring the cast expressing their gratitude to all the amazing fans who've made it all possible and acknowledging the bittersweet nature of the news. In the video, Sam reminded reminded us that every good story eventually ends. Katrina Balfe chimes in, saying, They always do, but don't let this bum you out because the production team has something special in store for us. John Bell promises they're going out with a bang, telling the story the way it deserves to be told. Sophie Skelton talked about how it's far from over. We get to be with our beloved characters for another year. Isn't that exciting? Sam and Balf said that they can't wait to bring us the final season and hope to make us proud. Balf also took to Instagram to share her excitement. She wrote about how she's gained lifelong friendships in the process of making this show. How adorable is that? She also talked about how the show pushed her to work on herself, both as an actor and a person, and promised to wrap up in style. During a chat on The Late Late Show, Katrina opened up about how Outlander has transformed her life. And it's a story worth sharing, my friends. Katrina started her acting career a bit later in the game, at the age of 30. Some people would say, oh, it's too late, you missed the boat. But Outlander proved them wrong. It gave her absolutely everything she needed and more. Talk about opening doors left and right. But wait, there's more. Katrina's enthusiasm is contagious as she dove into just how incredible this gig is. We're talking about working with the same fantastic bunch of people for a decade. They're not just colleagues, they're her trusty crew. Let's not forget about her character, Claire, who's an absolute force of nature. She's had the chance to tackle so many different challenges and push her boundaries, all thanks to who this character is. One of the most wicked and bone-chilling characters in Outlander, the infamous Stephen Bonnet, played by Ed Spilliers, also had something to say on the matter. TV Insider recently had a chat with Ed on how he feels about Outlander being renewed yet again, to which he jokingly said, that's a lot of Outlander. He also took a moment to give a shout out to the series that he believes completely transformed his career. Spieliers believes that the period drama has had a positive impact on everyone involved. It brought a massive change not just in actors and crews' lives, but also in the entire Scottish film industry. Now that's not a small feat. He also admitted how he never would have had a chance at many roles if it hadn't been for the role of Stephen Bonnet. Not only because the role brought new opportunities along with it, but also because it gave him the confidence to pursue other types of work. But that's not all. Guess who made an appearance on Good Morning America to spill some tea? Sam and Balf stopped by to talk about the brand new seventh series of our favorite historical drama. When asked about how they feel about the show nearing its end, Katrina shared that she's been feeling all the feels about the show coming to a close. She described it as a bittersweet moment that's going to hit us right in the heart. It's going to be a tough pill to swallow, no doubt about it. Sam also spilled the beans on the one keepsake he's snagging from the set after wrapping up season eight. He's definitely going to keep Jamie's weapons for one. Can you blame him? Those things are seriously cool. But wait, there's more. The real gem in his collection is Jamie's boots. Yup, you heard that right. Whenever Sam slips into those bad boys, he felt instantly transformed into the legendary Highlander. Talk about channeling the character. They also gave away some exciting news. Filming for the eighth and final season is just a few months away, and guess what? Katrina is not only gracing us with her incredible acting skills, but she's also stepping behind the camera to direct an episode. Talk about being multi-talented. She's already dabbled in directing by working with Sophie Skelton and John Bell in some second unit scenes this season. But here's the kicker. Sam hasn't experienced Katrina's directorial talent yet. Leave it to Sam to stir up some playful banter. With that trademark mischievous grin, he jumped in and declared, Oh, you should know, I'm a one-take wonder. I've got it all covered, triggering rounds of laughter from the studio. Oh, Sam, you know how to keep things light and entertaining. 
In January of 2023, while filming for the epic seventh season was still in full swing, the news dropped that our beloved time-traveling romance would be wrapping up with season eight. Cue the collective gasps from fans around the world. We thought we'd have at least 10 seasons, just like the book series. Sam also sat down for an interview on the Happy Sad Confused podcast. He shared how the decision to end the show with season eight was made while they were knee deep in the production of season seven. And boy, did the realization hit the cast hard. Sam revealed that emotions ran high as they approached the end of season seven. They could feel the atmosphere change on set. No one could shake the thought that they'd just be coming back once more and that'd be it. But let's not get too emotional just yet because we still have two more action-packed seasons to devour. Sam couldn't help but tease us with all the details about the new season. We're talking mind-boggling, jaw-dropping, can't believe it's real kind of stuff. Let's dive headfirst into the first few episodes and boy do they deliver. There are going to be major developments, twists and turns that'll leave you breathless. Brace yourselves for some mind-bending time travel shenanigans too. We're going to be inching our way toward the ultimate destination and it's going to be awesome. The new series is serving up a whopping 16 episodes and they're splitting it into two parts. The first half dropped on June 16th and we'll have to hold our kilts for the second half until 2024. Season six left us hanging with Claire facing a murder trial while our beloved Jamie races to save her. Talk about suspense, Hewan assured fans during his exclusive talk with US Weekly that they'll pick up right where they left off. That's a relief if you ask me. There's not a minute to lose when we've got that intense cliffhanger. Hewan had to admit the ending was something else entirely. It felt like they threw the usual playbook right out the window. Season seven will bring a bunch of new characters into the mix. We're talking Jamie Fraser's long-awaited son and a whole bunch of anticipated characters that fans have been dying to see. As for season eight, it is already in the works and is set to start filming in a few months but there's a little uncertainty in the air due to the ongoing writer's strike. Let's cross our fingers and hope it doesn't disrupt the plans too much. We're itching to dive into another season of Outlander goodness. Here's a little something to keep your spirits high. The prequel, Outlander Blood of My Blood, has been given the green light. This exciting new show will delve into the epic love story of Jamie's parents, Brian Fraser and Ellen McKenzie. And guess what? Matthew B. Roberts, the brilliant mind behind the original series, will be behind the wheel for this prequel as well. Roberts took to Twitter to express his gratitude, saying it wouldn't have come to life had it not been for the unwavering passion and loyalty of fans. And hey, he got that right. Hewan couldn't be more thrilled about the upcoming prequel, sharing his delight at the incredible new family that'll follow in their footsteps in the next show. So there you have it. From fans being unable to cope with not being able to see the Highlanders anymore, to Sam Hewan sending out a heartfelt message to devoted fans. This was how the Outlander cast reacted to season eight being the final season. 